I am so grateful for Lyra, Lyra to send me this amazing box of goodies. Beautifully packaged uh, uh, case of uh, pastels. They actually feel so nice. Uh, I'm not a I'm not a pastels artist, but this is really exciting me to experiment with them. And and look at these colors, amazing colors, all my favorite colors. Uh, God knows what I'm gonna start with, where I'm gonna start with all that. I don't think I'll ever throw the paper wrapping either. Uh, these, uh, these are, these look amazing, these, uh, beautiful brushes a selection of five uh, I think really all you need for uh, all you need for a, a one of my drawings uh, I wonder what they're like in terms of the nib and the uh, and the thickness of the nib really excited to start working with them feel great uh, you know they're so handy these these uh, pens. They look they look to me like brush paints. <laughs> look at me, I'm I'm so excited to open them. I can't I can't wait. They look to me like brush paints that uh, that are perfect for shadows. And if you're on the go and you can't have uh, and if you haven't got your water brushes and and paint, uh, they look ideal. Uh, anyway, I'm definitely going to do a sketch with these. Uh, the only question is, is which colors do I want, the cool or the warm grays? Amazing. And then we've got the, the pencils. They look like water-soluble pencils. Uh, they are really handy. In fact, I can use them as part of my watercolor drawings. Uh, and they... Are probably going to come in really handy. I wonder what colors there are. Okay, the perfect colors, the yellows, the greens, the reds, the blues, perfect, amazing. Uh, definitely going to use these. Look, I don't even have time to put them inside the box. Uh, charcoal, graphite, graphite, graphite. God, I haven't worked with graphite for such a long time. Uh, so that's going to be interesting doing some work with graphite sorry i'm being a little bit too zealous and too uh, uh too excited too excited um, they look they look brilliant uh, again i need to start thinking about the drawings that i'm going to use for these wow 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 so much to do thank you so much lyra this is amazing what an amazing gift, what an amazing gift. Uh, and of course, saving the best of last, my favorite medium, the watercolor. And um, what is interesting, this looks like it's got an enormous range of colors, a really big range of colors, uh, a lot more than I'm used to. I'm, I'm used to working with limited palette uh, I tell you the other thing that I really like is uh, this looks like solid paint, which I really like. I always use tube, uh, but solid is great, especially if you're traveling and if you're in a hot country or you're on the beach, then of course they don't melt. I've been carrying a tiny little palette with me. This is amazing. Okay, there's every single color that you need in there. That is absolutely perfect. Perfect. Exactly what the uh, what I need. And of course, uh, a pad, a Canson pad. Uh, and I haven't actually used one of these before. Uh, this particular Canson pad is a nice uh, A3 size-ish. Um, 
it looks roughly to me about 10 inches by about 14. Yeah, it's 9.8 by 14.2. 20 pages, uh, 300 uh, GSM. And I tell you uh, what I'm really intrigued by is the fact that this is 60% cotton. All of the, all of the uh, Kansen pads that I've used in the past were uh, cellulose, but this one is 60% cotton, which I think is gonna behave very differently to my other Kansen pads. This could be a bit of a, a, a game changer in terms of Kansen. Let's see how white or how bright they are. The paper is amazing. Okay, the paper is so nice. I've, I'm always looking for very nice uh, uh, whitish paper, and I think this does, does the trick. Lyra, thank you. I love you.